Hello, welcome to my channel. I am finally adding voice to my videos and I hope the information will help you. The nails are already prepped, and if you want to see how, click on the link on the right corner up on this video. The first dipping powder is from Nicole Diary Matte Color Number no. X12. I will start with the middle finger with two coats of light gel color and cure each of them under LED lamp for 30 seconds. I will apply top coat, because I want to use the dipping powder only on some place of the nails. The top coat layer I will cure it under LED lamp for 60 seconds. If you like my videos, please subscribe to my channel. I have weekly videos and more interesting content is coming up. With a thin painting brush I am taking some base coat and place some random shapes on the tip of the nail, just where I want the dipping powder to be. After placing the dipping powder, I will cure under lamp for 60 seconds. Using this technique for dipping powder is less messy than with the standard kit that you will know. After brushing off the excess powder, I apply a top coat layer to seal and finish the nail. The top coat I always cure it for 60 seconds to be sure it stays in place. For the pointer finger I will be doing the same process and only that lines on the tip will be little bit different, as it is a random look. Time for some music now and we'll come back for the ring finger.
ring finger, I will add a thin layer of base coat and use the thermal dipping powder from Born Pretty brand number TDN02, place under lamp for 30 seconds, brush off and repeat the process one more time. The gel base coat acts like the base coat glue, from dip powder kit, and the last gel base coat after applying two time the dipping powder, acts like the activator from dip powder kit. After curing this last base coat layer and remove the stickiness with some isopropyl alcohol, I can buff the nails with an actual buffer or a file of 240-240ths grid. It starts to reveal the color because of heat, but watch until the end, because it gets more interesting. Sometimes I do not need to use the buffer at this stage, but each category of dipping powder reacts differently because of its composition. So, you just have to test and see. After I have smoothed out the nail, at this stage the color will not be removed, I will apply the top coat and cure for 60 seconds. One more nail done. Pinky I will be doing same process of applying gel base coat and dipping powder twice. Now, I will be using the Nicole Diary with some glitter in it number AQ04. This color is very similar with the color of the polygel that I have been using, only that has some silver glitter in it. I will have to use the buffer on this nail too, because when I add the dipping powder, the base coat I did not apply it evenly and got bulky on the tip. It is the same thing with the base coat from the dipping powder kit, that acts like a glue, only that I find it more difficult to place that one on the nail plate evenly. Anyway, I will do a video with some swatches on my nails with both methods. I have video on reviews playlist with on tips. You can click on the right up corner of this video to check them out.
Let's test the thermal color on the ring finger in the cold water. It is a three color combination, light pink, orange and deep dark blue. I hope you enjoyed the video and see you next time.